we've just learned that the teenager hit and killed by a train over the weekend in Troutdale is a student at Estacada High School. The 17 year old was killed while he was taking his senior pictures. And now Union Pacific has a warning for everyone around train tracks. Elise Haas has more. Each year, hundreds of people are injured or killed while trespassing on railroad property in the United States. Now, a tragic story out of Troutdale, where a train hit and killed a 17-year-old while he was taking senior photos near the train tracks. The incident happened by the historic Columbia River Highway around 6 o'clock on Saturday. Union Pacific is responding, calling for attention to safety. In a statement, the company said, our thoughts are with the teen's family and friends. We plead with parents, students, and photographers to not take photos on or near the tracks. Steve Crines with the Rail Safety Education Organization, Oregon Operation Lifesaver, urges professional photographers to refrain from taking photos of high school seniors, wedding parties, and others on train tracks, saying many people don't realize it's against the law. They don't know that it's actually a misdemeanor. Um, they don't know that it's actually a crime to trespass on the tracks, and so, you know, they you they just go out on the tracks and they take these photos, and then an incident like this happens. Trains can't stop quickly, and the average train overhangs the track by at least three feet. Plus, looking through a lens creates an optical illusion, making it hard to determine a train's distance and its speed. People mimic photographers when they see photos online and on social media. This is a tragedy for the family. It's a tragedy for the community. It's a tragedy for the train crew. Um, you know, it, it, I think it's important to get out to the public that, you know, that for everybody to remember that the only thing that belongs on those tracks are trains. In Troutdale, Elise Haas, Coin 6 News. We talked to the Estacada School District and they told us their community is mourning this loss. They brought in counselors for their students and they're helping the family.